I started doing stained glass in 1972. My dad had taken an adult ed course in stained glass because he had bought an old house and wanted to learn how to fix this old lamp. So he started doing stained glass as a hobby and asked me to help him on a couple of pieces. And I totally caught the bug and just by complete luck fell into a job at a great old time stained glass studio. And then in 1989, I started my own studio. I'm Dan Marr. I was born in Cambridge, Mass. And I've never lived outside a four mile radius of the hospital I was born in. I can remember the first time I went with my dad to buy some glass down at the local supplier and looking at these bins of glass and scrap glass, it was just like jewels everywhere. The style of a window, I'll more govern that to the style of the architecture. Then when I decide on what the, what the style of the window is, I always look at what the light in the space is like. I consider my medium to be more light than the glass because the glass serves as a filter of either the intensity of the light or the color of the light. Stained glass seems to be like the magical material. I've only met one person in all of my years of doing glass that when I said, oh, I'm a stained glass artist, they were, stained glass doesn't do much for me. Everybody loves stained glass. Almost every single day, I discover some new fun idea to do with glass. So it's never become boring for me, ever. At the end of the day, I can be completely physically exhausted and mentally completely exhilarated. So how much fun is that? I know, that's, that's what it's all about for me. It's fun.